Hey guys, this is Data Wolf from Fallen Age Death Productions. Um, today we're doing a unboxing of the E3 Blue or the E Blue 3. Whatever it's called, Mazer Type R2 Advanced Wireless Gaming Mouse. Now you may be wondering why I went wireless. That's because I wanted to. So I've actually already opened this. As you can see, it comes in this lovely box. Um, just a bit of styrofoam, but um, on the front you'll notice its dimensions are 125, 80, and 40. Um, its net weight is 95 grams. It's an optical mouse. DPI goes 500, 1000, 1800, 2500. Max number of buttons is 6, and the refresh rate is 250 hertz. Um, and it has um, four way DPI switch an Avago gaming chip and cool lighting scroll. Now I've actually only pulled this out of the box just a few minutes ago to um, install the batteries. Um, as you can see, um, it comes with the wireless thingy, which is E3 Blue. And that's pretty much everything out of the box. Now on the back side of the box, you have everything in Chinese. Um, and it's just saying it's Microsoft Windows compatible, become a fan of Facebook, and it's made in China. Now, yep, well, let's receive up. Now, here's the mouse itself. It has a very, uh, a very wide profile in the hand, as you can see. So, so. Um, if we turn it over, and we turn it on... Now you'll notice on the back, it has the E3 blue label, the, ta the Mazer thing, um, pretty much the optical thing, on, off, and on with lights. Now turning it over, whoops, you'll notice turning it over it is very, very wide. It's got the balance ring here on the side. Um... It has the Mazer logo, E3 Blue, the DPI switch, which should flash depending on what setting you're on. Um, your mouse wheel, which looks sort of cool because it goes from the edge. Um, the lighting, and yeah. But that's the unboxing of the Mazer E3 Blue uh, Type R. If you have any questions, comments, let me know, and I'll try to answer them in the comments. Thanks, bye.